Hello, good evening. My name is Christy and I'm with Infinity of Denver. Today we look, we're looking at stock number M9502. It's a 2012 Infinity QX56, has 102,907 miles. One owner on Carfax, no accidents or damage reported. I'm gonna pop open the hood, that way we can look at what's going on there. This car has a lot of power. It's powered by a 5.6 liter, eight cylinder, seven speed automatic transmission. These cars do put out just about 400 horsepower. They'll get you where you need to go and they'll get you where you need to go with a smile on your face. On the front of this car, you do have a front camera as well as sonar, fog lights. You have high intensity discharge, automatic on and off headlights. Moving our way around the car, of course you've got chrome, on your um, accents all the way around the car, your handles above the windows on the trim, your air vent, and then of course um, your grill on the front of the car. You have uh, all season tires with 20 inch forked seven spoke aluminum alloy wheels. You've got running boards and splash guards on the car. On the back, of course, you've got sonar and a camera as well with this new body style. It is very gorgeous. You've got a self-leveling rear suspension, a power lift gate, a class four hitch with seven pin wiring. Um, you have power heated folding, um, integrated turn signals on your outside mirrors there. They do have memory and reverse tilt down with puddle lamp all on your outside mirrors. They pretty much do everything. You've got an alarm with an immobilizer. You've got roof rails on the top. Again, that around view monitor with sonar on the front and back. Speed sensitive rain sensing windshields with a de-icer. Give you a little bit of a look around both sides of the car there so you can take in the condition. Let's hop on in and see what's going on inside. On the inside of the car, You've got 10-way power drivers and 8-way passengers with lumbar and memory support seats. You've got one-touch windows and captain's chairs in your second row. So you've got split seating there. A huge center console. I'm going to go ahead and start this baby up so I can show you a few features. And this car was owned by one of our employees, brothers, so definitely very well taken care of. There you've got your around view monitor and you can get a top or a side view. You've got the sonar. You do have automatic door locks, Bluetooth for your phone and for audio. So you've got... Um, your music box also which is in the car but also your auxiliary and um, your music box all of that can be connected there you've got entry exit assist which means that your steering wheel will lift up as you get in and out of the car and your seat will move backwards to help you get in and out of the car a little bit easier of course you've got your steering wheel controls for audio voice commands cruise control Inside you've got your controls for four-wheel drive that you can go into. Beautiful wood trim. You've got chargers here. Of course you've got your heated seats, your third row return, heated steering wheel, another charger, and you've got dual climate control up in the front so you and whoever is your passenger, for me it's my husband, we don't have to fight over what the temperature is in the car. Of course you do have navigation as well. You've got an eight inch, eight inch uh, color touch screen and the Bose speaker system. There are 13 speakers in this car and you do have USB and auxiliary as well as that hard drive. You've got Sirius XM radio as well. The voice recognition, sequential welcome lighting and tu Tuscan burl wood trim is what this is called. 
give you a look around. I love that they've got the embroidered infinity emblem on the car. You've got an auto dimming mirror with garage door connectivity and a sunroof. The car reminds me a lot of mine. I really like it. Let's hop on into the back so you guys can see the back seat. In the back, you've got heated seats in your second row as well as another climate control there. You do have chargers here at the bottom and connectivity as well. Of course, you've got cup holders and a ginormous center console. You can literally pretty much fit my entire arm up to the elbow in there. It is lined like a jewelry box. And there's the other seat. You do have DVDs in the back, which you can hook up to that connectivity under the seat vents to help cool or heat off the car and vents up here as well. There is your third row seating. This car is really good interior condition. You've also got your um, third row that has air conditioning, cooling, um, climate control as well. And then your seat returns and cup holders in the third row. One of the things I like about this car is how the seats actually do flip up um, so you can get into the back seat very easily. You can see I flipped up the seat, plenty of room to get into the third row should you need to use it. You can easily push that back into place with one hand. Right. I do want to give another view of everything on the car so you can check out the exterior condition. And the only other thing I typically like to do from the inside of the car is give you a full view of the front of the car. That way you can see what the interior looks like up at the front. If you do have any other questions or would like to schedule a time for a test drive, my name is Christina and I'm happy to help.